Greetings. Greetings, greetings everyone! My name is Altarian and welcome to the livestream Opus Echo of Star Song. I have played this game a couple years ago when it was just normal and with that I mean without the voice acting which it has now. Welcome Xavier, thank you for waiting, thank you for waiting, how are you doing? How are you doing? Oh, thank you for the wait, thank you for the wait. Let's see. I'm gonna double check if the live stream is going good. Hmm, for once the music is more silent um, than normally. This is uh, interesting. Let me quickly adapt the music a little bit more. There we go, the, a classic 4.9 decibels. There we go, let's see how this goes. Good to hear that you're doing good. Good to hear, good to hear. All right, as you can see guys, I have played Opus Egg of Star Song a while ago and uh, yeah, I even got all the, the memories. I won't spoil too much for those who have not seen it, but there is a lot to do, a lot to see. So we are going to um, reset the game, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, Xavier. I had a little, a little urgent, urgent. Normally I'm just sitting here preparing everything, but sometimes the program does a little bit weird or it crashes, but I'll try to be on time every single time. Apologies for the 30 seconds delay. Alright, let's restart. Reset the game. Wait, do I need to adjust the settings? Ah, that's why. The settings were still from the past. Let's see how this goes. Go to like a, a 7, just in case. Or an 8. Reset the game! Yes, reset the game. Everything will be gone. Oh my god. It's been years ago. Guys, this game is a beautiful game, first of all. It was, I think, in 2020... 2022? Or 2021? 2022? 2021? I think 2021. December 2021, I played this game. It is my most popular game on my channel so far. A lot of people like it and I still get a lot of subscribers for this game. But this game has received so far, it has received voice actors since then. Eh, let me double check. This voice language, Japanese, Chinese, Mandarin. Let's just go with, uh, I'd say let's go with Japanese. Since that's the most commercial one. All memories continue. How do I continue? No, I want to start a new game. I want to start a new game. Start over. Oh my god. Chapter 1, 2, 3. Oh, so good memories. No, uh, Xavier, it is not as scary. Opus games. I'll do this until all the games are over. It is an emotional indie game. All of those games are uh, emotional. I've done a couple of scary games in the past, but now it's focused on Opus. It's about emotions. It's about a lot of crying. I don't know if you have played ever emotional games, but you will cry like crazy after this, uh, at the ending of this game. I know, I know, Xavier, I know. There will be enough live stream of scary games in the future, but we must alternate a little bit. We must alternate. Alright, let us start over. Normally the... The voices should be... Japanese, I'm curious to hear it. Very curious for what they've done. Unregistered asteroid. Unknown Lumen Cave. Asteroid Center Gravity Center. 0 0.8 standards. Jeez. <laughs> Xavier, Xavier. I will hold on to it. I won't say boo now. Cave ecological conditions ideal. Oxygen levels 90%. Sufficient prepared for landing. Oh, it's been a while, guys. Oh, that sounds so good! Oh my god, I remember back when I played this game in the past, I voice acted myself, or at least I tried to give them voices, but wow, hearing them having their own voices, that's a really well-chosen voice. But, uh, shall I? Yeah, you know what, I'll read it. Now I won't voice act, I'll just read it out loud in my own voice. But Taiyang's mercy. Commencing exploration. Lovely. Really lovely. Oh my god, I know everything is going to happen and that's so awesome. Hmm. 
The music is beautiful as well. Very nice to hear, very nice. Forgive me, Clown Master, but you have no data about this place. Nicely how they've also done it with a bit of this radio distortion. Love it, distortion. You do not have to put yourself in danger like this. Anyone in the clan would be honored to explore on your behalf. Oh, it's so beautiful to hear, guys. I've explored more than my shares of Lumen Caves in my youth. Besides, no clan master should put his own people in danger. Oh my god. So good. Xavier, hi is hi in every single language. <laughs> hi is hi. We say hello, but we also have hello. Like hello, hello. We say hello, hello. Hi, hello. But sir, you have dedicated your entire life to the clan. Why? With the clan daily business is behind you now. Why trouble yourself with a person you knew for such a short time? So Xavier, say how are you in Belgium? Who got it? Nee, yeah, who got it? Who got it? <laughs> I was questioning myself, like, huh? How, how do I say that? Forgive me. <coughs> Listen close. From now on, I'm no longer head of the Lee clan. I'm J I am Jun Lee. Oh, he speaks a little bit slower than I anticipated back in the past. Didn't imagine. I failed to be there in the back then. I failed to be for her back then. Oh, wow. My English, guys, today is no English. I failed to be there for her back then. So let me live out my life before it ends. Oh, yes, I forgot we could move. I could move. Awesome. Ah, oh, such a badass voice. It's more of a movie like for me now. Because the voice acting is done in my stead, I love it. Lumen. There is a lot of history about this. I'm still hoping they will make something like, I don't know, like a book or like an animation about it or a comic about it. There is so much possibilities with uh, the concept and the world that they created. 8 Orbis, 6 Circum, 17 Gradus. May the eons realign the stars so we may find each other in death. Oh, Helios, Lord of Myria, despite the life of Toll, you were still met with eternal separation from your love. Awesome, dude. Really awesome. The Myria Empire reached prestigious heights. Welcome to the live stream, Arun Kazuma. Welcome, welcome on Twitch. How are you doing? How are you doing? Xavier, I'm not going to scream. It's not a horror game. It's an emotional game with a beautiful story. If we ever have another chance, I hope we don't lose ourselves to the Lumen. See, I've played this game already, so I know what it is, but I want you to just enjoy their voices that they have, because my voice cannot do its justice, what the story is all about. I just simply cannot. 
It's too good. It's too beautiful. It's their best game so far. Oh wow, this gives so many memories. So many memories, especially because it's also... Edda. Will I ever hear your voice again? Especially because this was also the beginning, more or less, of my YouTube channel. Opus, Echo of a Star Song. It's crazy how much uh, I've grown back then and now. Ciao, ciao, Xavier! You're welcome back anytime! Become a great seeker of Lumen and bring honor to our clan. Those were my mother's last words. Words I can recall even to this day. Clan Master of Lee. Ninth of the Ocean. Nine of the East Ocean Clans. Jun Lee. Hundreds of years ago, near the edge of the galaxy, there was a solar system known as the Thousand Peaks. Japanese are pretty badass, regardless of whatever they're reading. Here, ruins of an ancient lumen civilization were discovered throughout the asteroid belt. Within years, the once looted, secluded region became a hotbed of conflict between fractions from every corner of the galaxy, fighting to gain control of the Lumen. Hmm. I think I can increase a little bit of the volume, can't I? How does the settings work? I completely forgot how the settings here were. Was it like a J? Was it W, X, C? Clicking. Buttons. One by one, because I forgot what the options button was. Was it a tab? Was it a... I completely forgot what the options button was in this game. It's not escape. Oh well, I'll find it. I can do it like this. Let's see how this sounds. However, this failed to bring about peace. The lure of Lumen was far too powerful to control. Okay, that's better. Now we've got the good audio. Smaller conflicts rage on and the masses continue to fight over the valuable resources. Eventually this gave rise to rampant pri piracy and illegal excavation. As the flames of chaos continued to burn, criminal activity throughout the asteroid belt spiraled out of control. And in the end, United Mining was forced to loosen its grasp and made Lumen publicly available throughout newly introduced regulations. This change in policy quickly transformed Thousand Peaks from a war zone into a heaven for Lumen-seeking explorers. And so people from all the corners of the galaxy flooded in with one goal in common. To discover the Lumen. And a chance of glory and untold riches. Badass. And I was among them.
an exile who had been driven from home. It was 60 years ago when I first met Ada. Oh, Ada, they say. I always thought it was Ida. But Ada is nice as well. Chapter 1. My god, the memories. The memories. United Mining Sector 9, Lumen Mining Act. Trade Transfer Station Fortune 9. Oh, I'm curious to hear his voice when he was younger. Migrants Bazaar. You have reached a memory point in chapter 1, which contains saved data from all the playthrough. Do you wish to overwrite data? Yeah, overwrite. If you choose to overwrite the data chapter will be permanently replaced. Yeah, sure, overwrite it. Got no problem with it. Oh, that's completely not the voice that I gave it in the past. Nice to hear it. Give up, cave runner. You don't have what it takes to find caves. Woo! What a nice voice! I love it! How would you know? Please, help us give the intel. Intel? I just sold it to you. Nice! You just gave us a photo with some vague directions. A cave could be any one of the hundreds of asteroids in that area. Where will we even start? Nice. Don't you have a witch in your crew? No wonder you can find her. Miko? Witch? What are you talking about? Oh, what a sneaky, sneaky trader. You're from the East Ocean, aren't you? I can tell by your accent. Don't tell me you don't even know what a witch is. In any case, you already took home money. You should honor your end of the deal. Oh, I love him. Calm down, June. No need to get worked up. Get lost, kid. I don't even do business without matures who can't even afford a witch. Say it again, there is no way someone like you is gonna find any car. Ah, put me down! Say whatever you want, but don't you dare insult my young master. Let him go, Kai. Nice! And listen up, we East Oceaners don't work with witches. I knew it, I've seen the way you talk, you're East Ocean nobles. You outsiders make me sick. You came mining our caves like your own place, like you owned the place. Then ran off faster than anyone when United Mining came along. Ow. How dare you come crawling back? It's difficult to guess. When they stop speaking, because I don't know what she's saying or where she is in the phrase, you know? Don't you have a witch? Figure out yourself. How do you want to handle this, sir? Let him go. We can talk this through. Beat him until he gives up the intel. Well, previously we were playing the good person. Shall we play the bad one? Nah, let's play the good one. I don't want to beat up anybody. Hey, let him go first. Oh. She sounds so sweet. Mary, you're never lasting. Perhaps we can offer a better deal. 
Ah, oh, bless my fortune, and who might you be? Oi, hey, what are you doing? Oh, she has a bit of a young voice, it's soothing. These thugs don't need your attention. Why not sell us the intel instead? Our witch can locate the cave in no time. Music to my ears. Finally, a proper vessel crew. That'll be 600 credits, kind runner. Deal. Here's my account. Send the payment in three standard hours, and the intel will be in your inbox. No problem. You will receive a transaction under the name Ida. May Lumen be with you always. Give your uh, witch many thanks and see ya. Oh, oh, hey! Wait. Don't go! Tell the girls of transaction. Send Kai to stop them. We'll be independent. We'll do it ourselves, did they? Because it is a new edition of the game. It's not just um, Opus Echo of a Star Song. I think. What was the name? I already forgot. Was it not Full Bloom Edition? Wait, wait. Hold on, the trader is trying to scam you. Oh, it's so nice to hear them speak. Whoa, she's back as well. I missed her. Hey, back up. Ah. Nice, I love her voice. They already made a deal. What do you want with Eddie? Out of the way, kid. Kai, wait, she's just a child. Good lumen, there goes the rat. Your business is done here, what else do you want? Careful, Remy. They might hurt you. Oh, the whole crew is here! Awesome! Woo! Listen, don't buy the intel, it's worthless. If you don't believe me, take a look. Pfft. That's what a liar would say. Remy, manners. Oh, why should I be nice? I don't want speaking us on picking on our speakers. I'm sorry, what you say may be true. Of course, just look at this photo. But I dislike violence. Uh, first of all, Ida, we didn't do any violence, okay? Never lost in paths. Goodbye. What's wrong with these people? Oh, there is no voice acting here. Let it go, June. You can't blame them. East Ocean did promise Thousand Peaks during the war that it wouldn't surrender to United Mining. But we ended up being the first one to do so. Welcome to the live stream, Vale. Hard to complain about people hating us after what happened. We were so close to getting the intel. Hey, don't worry. We can get the Lumen Association to help. When were they ever willing to help us? Well, the Reds say they were from the Association. If we go and tell them about our unfinished business, I'm sure they'll be willing to help out. Trades Transfer Station Fortune 9. This was where Ida and I first met. Kay wasn't too fond of them. From what I remember, the place was a bustling space station. Oh yes, this brings so many memories. In cooperation with United Mining, the Lumen Association was set up in the 18th and final year of the Lumen War to resolve disputes regarding mining rights. A system was put in place to resolve conflicts and give Intel brokers legal standing with the goal of maintaining stability in Thousand Peaks and preventing further bloodshed. Yet another victim. You're not from here, are ya? You know what? Since the voice acting is not everywhere, I'll try to do some voice acting. <clears throat> we don't know this trader. But he showed us his association ID. 
I still need to get in. I didn't prepare anything. Fortune 9 is a new trading hub. The place is full of scammers. Listen. These traders team up with local pirates and send people like you to the bases using fake intel. Once they ambush you, they'll disassemble your ship and sell the parts on the black market. Is this the photo he showed you? Ah, uh, you may think this is an untouched cave, but it's actually home base of the Bones Brigade, a gang of pirates notorious for smuggling lumen. Any runner with those common sense would know to stay away from this place. You don't have a witch, do you? Here, I'll give you the coordinates. This witch star song was copied recently. Parsing, uh, parsing, it will give you an exact location. If you've got nothing better to do, you're welcome to get rid of them as for us. And tell any runner you know to keep an eye out. The association isn't here to babysit outsiders, you know. Obtained pirate recorded star song. Pirate recorded star song star song rumbles from the depths of the asteroids by analyzing them one could glean the coordinates of lumen asteroids making them highly coveted item in the market however only the emissaries of the marion gods the witches could record them is uh, license operations under the lumen mining act welcome to the live stream stasia how are you all doing what can i do for you little runner we are going to buy some goods. Then we're gonna sell some goods. Then we have nothing, we just leave. Let's go to the shrine. May Helios blessings be upon you. That's how everyone greeted us as we walked to the center of the shrine. It is said that Helios came down from the heavens, bringing blessings to Thousand Peaks. The myth ends with Ignis calling the wrath of the heavens down upon the land, but that does not deter the faithful who still exist in great numbers. Fortune 9 was an up and coming trading hub that served as a transition point between the restricted area and the asteroid belt. Even though it was hard to trust the traders around here, Lumen Intel was the primary product for sale. That's one of the greatest reasons Sky and I came here to investigate Lumen. Navigator. Saving. There we go. But hey, young mercy. I hope these girls never find the place. We should go warn them. It's their own business. Nothing we can do about it. But you're, you're still concerned. Of course I am. Do you remember why we're here in Thousand Peaks, young boss, huh? Find Lumen Caves, restore honor and prosperity to the clan, I know, I know. This isn't the time to help others. Well, maybe helping these people out will restore some honor too. Okay! Good Lumen, don't get all happy yet. If things were the other way around, they wouldn't have left you to the pirates. They would have left you to the pirates without blinking an eye. Let's parse the star song the association gave us to see where they went. Okay, first of all, how do I... So, we can move. I know we can move, but how do I open the menu, guys? It's been ages. I know there were buttons for it, but which buttons were for it? It's not the tab. It's pressing them one by one, guys. How do you bloody open the menu? It's escape. It's F1. F2? No. It's... It's... Uh, what buttons do we have? Home. No. Is it backspace? No. No! Oh, but they did upgrade the interface. Nice. Z is back. I know Z is back, but how do I get back to the menu, guys? How do I get back to the menu? Uh, uh, uh. So, I kind of forgot how I go back to the menu in general. I thought it was Z, but there is no Z. Well, you know, let's move up to here. Regardless, let's go to the asteroid belt. Analyzing signal, electromagnetic scan complete, potential undiscovered cave. So, I see C for travel. <laughs> I think, I think you cannot leave the game. I'm gonna stay here for forever, guys. Alright, I'll see you next year. We should keep our heads down. We're still on the run. It would have been better not to get involved. Guy. You can just take back your words like that. 
Have you tried escape? Yeah, I'm trying escape. I'm trying it. I'm pushing it, but there is no escape. I know. I just hope we don't get into any trouble. Welcome back, Xavier. We're just catching. We're just catching up to warn them. Uh, it'll be fine. Fine, fine, fine. But you, you're gonna regret this. They have a witch on the ship. What exactly are witches anyway? War machines, Kai. Uh, June. Our clan rarely talks about them. But they were the main reason why East Ocean was defeated in the Lumen War. If it wasn't for the ability to detect Lumen, I doubt anyone would like them. Looks like an average Lumen cave. Look closer. See those entrances on the side? That's a sure sign this place is being converted. That's an uh, organi organized gang. So are those two, uh... No sign of any ship nearby, must have been lured in already. Can't say for sure what'll happen to them. If they're lucky, they'll just lose their ship. And if they aren't, well... Isn't there anything we can do? We'll have to leave the ship outside and sneak in through one of the entrances. I'm ready! Alright, alright, let's do this! Remember to follow my orders once we're in. Sorry, I didn't expect this to be dangerous. Ah, it's just some pirates. Grab your Synthoceptor, we better get going. Obtained Starsong Synthoceptor. Starsong Synthoceptor. Raise thy scepter and play the song of stars. Even in even to this day, the precepts passed down during my training as a cave runner remain clear in my mind. Okay. If I recall, this was the first looming cave I set foot in since arriving in Thousand Peaks. The anxiety of knowing that it was also a pirate base did a little to contain my excitement. Explore. There we go. We're diving in deep. We're diving in very deep. Asteroid 745 Lumen Cave. Ooh, guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh, yes. I remember this scene. Voice acting is back. Ooh. Ooh, close call, June. You better listen, boy. You better listen. Ah, there's somebody already in. They have been definitely alarmed. I'll try not to voice act the match. Ah, finally! Woo! We got settings! Escape! Woohoo! <laughs> we can press escape! Finally! Woohoo! Great! Great! So, uh, let me increase the master volume just by one more, maybe. Or maybe... I don't know if the sound is good, but let me just do one more. I just want to make sure that you guys really have a good, uh, good audio. Let me just go to, like, everything to nine. Hopefully it is good. Hopefully you still hear my voice on top of this. Voila, we'll go like this. We'll go like this. The voice acting is amazing. Oh my god, I love this game. I love it. It's beautiful. Is there some way to sneak in through the gate? How is the audio right now, guys, if I speak on top of it? Okay, I think that's a good combination. I like this, I like this, I like this. Only war veterans can cover and convert caves into base like this. These people don't mess around, boy. Everybody! Everybody! Oh? Yeah. Oh, my God. oh, it's so good. Oh my god, I love the voice acting. Over here. Be careful when you climb the scaffolding. We don't want to draw any attention. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're climbing. We're climbing the scaffolds with very much attention, without drawing attention, so that we are very advantageous. Oh, more information. I told you to keep up with this mural. Lovely, they even implemented these things. Wow, they, I, I don't remember these conversations being there. It's lovely. They've done a good job with this new addition. By Taiyang mercy, our faith really is connected to the Mirian culture in Thousand Peaks. Okay. The basic dude. Well, they're all caves to me. Oh, a cave is a cave. Cave is a cave. Holy suffering. One Orbis, zero circum, zero gradus. Pray, Sidio, composes to us. This mural depicts the myth of how Ignis' eyes, blue essence, was transformed into lumen after his flames had faded. The lumen flowed without end, eventually giving birth to the Mirian gods. However, their inability to control the energy of Ignis within them meant that at any given moment they might be engulfed in the flames of suffering. Yeah, the holy suffering. Everything sounds more epic when you add holy to it. Suffering, the holy suffering. Wrath, the holy wrath. The burger, the holy burger. Yeah, that sounds so much more epic. There's a gate here. Don't touch it. We don't want to draw any attention, boy. Don't worry, don't worry. I wasn't going. I wasn't going. Let's go then. I follow you, Kai. I follow you, Captain. You teach me the ways of the surviving, the survival. The port's just up ahead. Ooh, I couldn't read that fast. No one's patrolling that spot? We should try to get over there. Sir, yes, sir! Look around for a way up. Yeah, I'll keep watch. Sure, I'll look around uh, for a way up. Uh, yep, yep. Let me touch the gate. Not touch the gate, touch this. No. Uh, sir, I found a staircase! Kaito, okay, I found That's a way! Let's go. Good, let's go, buddy. Oh, ducking. Boys ducking. Ooh. Those ships look like they're legally modified. They probably break up the ship they snatch to build these, or sell the parts on the black market. Damn, this game has received such an upgrade. Such an upgrade. Nice audio, nice um, texts, voice acting is amazing. This spot should be safe. Oh yeah, get the interceptor out. What's wrong, boy? Aren't you going to open the gate? I'm waiting for your orders, Captain. I love his smirk on his face. He's proud. He's definitely proud. I see you've already grown as a runner. He's definitely proud. The copy I made of the Witch Star song. Did you bring it? Of course, Captain. The copy of which star song? A star song that had been copied countless times. It uh, it was so degraded. It has it was so degraded. The audio could hardly be made out. The sound seduced countless runners into the same prelude situation. But it was also what brought Ida and I together. Good. Try opening the gate. All right. Let's perform. Yes copy of the song. Let's go. I love it. He also clicks it and then he pops it. Oh, I love this part. Nothing happened, sir. What am I supposed to do? Because the sample is too degraded, boy, don't you know? 
Then why did you? Calm down. I'm trying to teach you a lesson here. Boy! Keep your eyes open. You see that over there? Song pipes there. Song pipes. A contraption unique to Thousand Peaks. Sometimes when we're exploring the sample or performing, just might not be up to the uh, up to scratch. Normally this would bring our progress to a halt. Just like our situation now, we were only where we only have a second-hand sample. Well, my reading is super bad today, guys. Oh. Ah, oh. so that's how you do it. I always wondered. But it's as if these song pipes exist to solve this very problem. Even when we have a poor sample, by Tarion's mercy, the lumen will guide our way. I always wondered the sound that they make. Don't these bandits pirates hear this? I mean, it vibrates through the whole system. Songpipes, archaeological research indicates that when the Myrian gods cultivated proved, proved ineffective, they relied on songpipes to enhance their voices. Only then were they able to enter the gates. This unique feature made it much easier for modern cave runners to open them. Alright, let's go! Let's go inside. So this is how it looks inside the pillar. Looks like, looks like it has been abandoned after all the valuables were excavated. This is our chance. Keep up, boy. Hi, Captain. I'm following you. Oh, quickly. Look, there's a canister of lumen. This must be what they've been smuggling. If they have resorted to ro robbing runners, I doubt there is much left of it. Low quality hybrid lumium. Ignis is Miriam god of creation, and when the flames of his creation faded, they became a blue crystalline essence which could be refined into liquid or gas. United Mining used it as an industrial fuel and it is known by its common name, Lumen. Oh, yeah. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. I understand that there was a older civilization, but didn't these people have like easier ways to go around or was everybody climbing up? What if somebody had a, you know, like a cramp during climb? Don't they have like staircases? Good, you're keeping up. Of course I'm keeping up, I'm an experienced runner. It's a dead end. Keep your eyes open, the lumen guides your way. Yes, yes, Captain, I know. Pop it up. Yes, copy of a star song. Let's go. Pop it. Nice. And now it vibrates and opens the gate. So wonderful. Amazing. Amazing. Not bad. Come on. No, you come on. You follow me, boy. I'm the I'm taking the lead here. I'm taking the I'm I'm taking the, the rain. That's the road. I'm taking the rain. Oh, 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 let me sneak a peek. Oh yeah, oh yeah, they have really established a big, it's a big base, not just minor things anymore. The gravity in, in Lumen Caves are somehow all but in standard range, but sure how it, not sure how it works, but it makes a decent basis. There are there are theories of Lumen being inseparable from gravity. It allowed the gods to communicate through time and space. Let's save the lectures for later. Sure, sure. Just trying you know, to learn a bit. It might be important. We might miss a thing or two. Aha. This is interesting. A lumen transmutation engine. 
What, didn't you see those during your training back home? Feels different to see the real deal, doesn't it? Of course it does. Of course. Another mural. Myrian gods, Presidio, the guardians of Lumen asteroids. Carving of these deities could be found in Lumen valves. It is believed Presidio is split into hundreds of forms, present whenever Lumen can be found. Besides protecting Lumen, they are responsible for recording history, and their account could be seen all over Myrian inscriptions. So what are they? They're like snakes? Like thousands of slithering things? That's a pretty scary god, I don't even know what it is. It's horrifying, now that I'm playing it for the second time, I have a bit of a, you know, a bit of a open mind to this. Here, this should be the main. Luminite liquid pipe, normally these would reach deep into the asteroids. Would those still be down there? It's worth, it's worth trying. The main shrines are usually near the core, which makes them a good spot for establishing base camp. Let's hope. Let's hope. Alright. First of all, no. First of all, we must pop a bit of energy on top of there. Yep, which star song. Let's go. This one is flowing, but it's only half the energy. We need a little bit more juice. We need a bit of this. Pop it, boy. Good job. We are filling the machine, the engine. Yes. Alright. Chamber is filled, that's true. Now that the transmutation chamber is filled with lumen, you remember what to do next? Use Star Song to activate the chamber so that luminite inside vaporizes into aluminium. Lumium gas. Yeah, I remember those trainings. I've been studying the books very well. For sure I've been listening. And now it's gas. And the gas flows towards the pipes. Yes. But now it's locked, so it. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. What's happening? It had a bit of an overload, didn't it? Too much of the good stuff. Looks like the chamber was too full. Overloading the old machine. Be careful, the lumen resonates within itself, so it's entirely possible to cause a chain reaction that blows up the whole place. Sure. But we are going to save Ida. Going to save Ida. Beautiful, love it. Oh yeah. And there we go. Don't hesitate to kill them. Wow, I can't read that fast. Since it is, uh, since it's an, um, voice acting now, I can't follow so fast. That's a bit difficult. That's a bit difficult. Are you sure the internet is legit? I can't say I'm entirely confident. Thank you for the hearts. It's a lot of fake dealers when I was on the streets. This looks like one of those scams where they team up with pirates to rob people. I know, I know, we need to take some risks. Fine, fine, let's go through the plan one more time then. Haha, <laughs> of course, my dearest Remy. I love their voices, it's so nice to hear uh, the audio change. So many years ago, plan A? If it's really the information, I'll wait for you to 
If the intel is legit, you'll wait for me outside. Plan-ni? I should learn Japanese to understand what they're saying. Maybe that would be nice. If the place turns out to be a pirate base, I'll tell them I'm a witch. And convince them that I can help them find Lumen Caves if they let me go. I go silent for 24 hours, you'll try to contact me. And most importantly, no matter what happens, you'll come to save me. Uh, yeah, uh, Stacia, the character designs is beautiful as well, I like it. Yeah, learning Japanese is definitely gonna be hard. I don't even know where to start. Exactly. I love Remy, so nice. That was one of my favorite characters for sure. I really loved Remy. She has a good heart. She really wants to protect what's hers. Woo! Well, that's definitely plan A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Ah, <laughs> come out. No use hiding. <laughs> Oh, station, nice. Okay, this one's out. It's time for plan B. Uh, Ida, it's not plan B. This is plan Z. They're blasting you with guns. Oh, Remy, I told you. I'm gonna charge into to get you now. Hold on, we don't know how many ships they have around. We stick with the plan. If I'm not out here after 24 hours, contact Dr. Russell. You coming out or not? Pay the ransom, and your friends can uh, come and get you. We'll play nice. Oh, I like that dude. He's he's kind of a, a chill gangster. Mary, you're never lasting. Master, watch over me. Woo! Risky girl. Very risky. They've got guns. They've got weapons. Oh, yeah. Looks like I've got a wrong runner. Are you in charge of this place? I'm here to make a deal. The last guy say as well, oh, surround her. Hey Tim, found her friends yet? Bossy! 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 Scan the national of the ship! Bossy! I'm serious, I'm here to talk. We know how the game works. Get to the chase then. What are you here for? Kikeh. Mikayo. Mikayo, that's cool. Which Mikayo? 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 Watashiwa Mikayo. Nanda to. Nanda to. Oh, that's one of my favorite words. But usually, you know, Nanato, <laughs> if you watched anime, it's usually these, uh, like a surprise, or like, Nanato! <laughs> uh, I'm recognizing some words. I need someone to help me find caves. Uh-oh. Guys, she's up ahead. Keep your voice down. Alright, let's go save her. Let's be heroes! Let's be heroes! Let's go save Ida! Where's the other person? Is she waiting on the ship? I can't hear what they're saying. Quiet, let me listen. Goodness, look who the rat sent us, a witch. Oh, 
Isn't finding keys what you do best? Liu Miak Taisen de Sankai Zendo no Liu Miak o Mitsuke da Shitano. Omae san tachi da. Didn't you people locate every single cave there is in the peaks during the war? Watashi ga deki ru no wa hakken made. Tansa ga deki ru hito ga hoshii no yo. Anata tachi teki nin jana. I can find them, but I need runners to help me explore. I believe this is what you do best. Sanari, Omae ga sagashite. So you tell us where to go when we dig up the place. What's the split? None. It's all yours. All I want to know is what you find. That's a bad deal. You never do give everything. It sounds super shady. It sounds too suspicious. Get out of here. That's what I'm saying. It's too suspicious. No deal. No splits. Never seen a deal like this, lads. But I have one condition. If you and the United Mining are searching for the same cave, you have to beat them to it. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? What? That's it? Who'd sneak in the caves expecting to be caught? So we have a deal? For a deal this good. You know, just a moment ago I thought I hated witches. I can learn Japanese by repeating what I say. But he goes too fast. Your self-righteous witches thought you were going doing the right thing when you sided with the United Mining to end that stupid war. And now the whole peak is just one big lawless mess. It was a foolish war and a foolish decision. We were the first time Nice, tense music also in the background. These people here, they're all peakers who were displaced by the war. If it weren't for you people, we wouldn't be here doing this kind of business. So my revenge starts with you, liar. Wait, I'm not lying! Something's going on! Don't go, it's too late. Sorry, I can't send this towards. Go! Save her! Jordan, Just kidding, I admire your courage. But I don't have business with liars. Boy, Alright, let's send her off. Now! Woo! Big mistake, buddy! Big mistake! It's a trap! She's got backup! Don't move! I'm a witch! Wait, I don't know them! I caught one! Step back, let me handle this! Oh yeah! I said don't move, this is tense! This is tense! One more step and I blow her head off! Who do you work for? Lumen Association, United Mining? Boss! We found a ship hiding on the dark side of the asteroid. The model's from East Ocean, it's a noble ship! They found Kun? A witch into Oceaners, nobles? What combination is this, and what are you doing all the way out here? I don't know them! Shut up, you almost had me there. Damn it, this is bad. I, Are you a big dude, don't move. You look like you've seen some action. You know what to do next, yeah? So first of all, just if we look to the left side, we've got K and we've got Junli. So, that boy is holding a stick. He's holding a stick. Now if we look to the right side, we have a couple of friendly people. 
who are holding one, two, three, four, five guns, ready to just make cheese out of us. What are you going to do with the stick, boy? Just what are you going to do with the stick? You're gonna sing a song? Maybe a fancy stick stage, indeed. Oh, but Kai has a weapon. I have two questions. First and count three, you let her go and I let him go. Second, you leave our ship alone. I agree on the first one. But you want me to let your fancy ship go? Boss! Boss! If you all agree, I'm counting to three. To say you got me good. Was pretty convincing, act liar. Now walk. I really don't know these people. Thank you for the hearts, everyone. Hey, kid. Oh, you're speaking so fast, guys. Read faster. I'm not clicking anything. Oh, this is tense. This is, this is the trade off. This is the trade off. It's like watching a movie now. I love it. Ooh. Oh! Shit! Oh. I remember this. I remember this. This was super tense. This was super tense. Woo. Oh, he's bleeding. Gaki. Omae kore ga uijin ka? You knew to this game on ticket. Never reveal yourself in a fight. Otherwise, I can just take you out first. Aye, Aye, this kid is a noble. Lock them all up and bring in their ship. What about the witch? Boss. Boss. Same, lock her up. Hey boss, the witch tried to set us up. I reckon we should kill her just to be safe. I said lock her up. Don't you dare to lay a finger on her. Boss! We're pirates, not butchers. Yeah, they use mafia. Mafia is a different word than butchers. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Awesome. Ah, the gate isn't responding to my performance. Wow, I'm so excited. This is really awesome. Ah, what a good game. What a good moment. Really awesome. I'm like reliving my uh my past. They even removed the song pipes. I believe I can help you. I'll figure a way out. You're using a, a copy of the SAR song they uh, sold on the market, right? Ah, oh, Jun Lee, he really wants to play the cool guy. Like, I don't need your help. It's fine, I can do myself. No need for for whoever you are. I degraded sample isn't going to work, no matter what you do. Besides... This would have been part of their plan. If you don't get a cleaner sample from somewhere deep in the cave, you'll have no way of opening that gate. Otherwise, it would have taken your synthesizer already. Ah, oh, damn it, guy is bleeding. He's taken a couple of bullets over there. What is this? United Mining. Smuggling containers. These labels look nearly identical to their commercial counterparts. Low quality. Halimalium. 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 What is this? Principles of the Ring Liberation. Front 8,531st edition. Endless lumen. Light away. That the belt may rise again one day. 
This principle is guiding the Ring Liberation, Front's guerrilla squad, a group of warriors who opposed the United Mining after Lumen War. Many of them became mercenaries or pirates. Pirato. They became pirato. If we don't find a way out, Kev will bleed to death. I know, boy. I know. Mirian God Binary. Binari is two gods whose head and tail were adjointed, never to meet, representing the never-ending flow of space-time. Legend has it that the gates of the Binari reach beyond time and space, and those who pass through may be met with anyone from anywhere. Traveling peakers would often utter the prayers to Binari to each other before setting off for long journeys. Is he alright? I applied some basic first aid, but that's all I can do for now. Ah, it isn't good. Okay, those are famous last words. I don't say them out loud. I just need some rest. Those are famous last words. It's not my fault. Well, it's a good learning experience for the future clan master. Don't worry about it. Let me know if you need any help. Yes, please, I need help. Let's have a talk. How did things end up like this? What, you need me? I love it how she's the dissing him a little bit. Hey, what do you, you need me to wrap you up too? Do you think we got you into this, don't you? I just helped you. Wow. Don't tell me that this is the translation. I just helped you. What are you going on about? And she said, Nanyo. That was it. Nanyo. I, I just helped you. What are you going on about? Nanyo. Okay. Okay. I apologize, but at the time, you looked like you were in danger. What are you trying to say? That you helped me? True station, it could be about context, indeed. I mean, no such thing, but K is an honorable Eastern Ocean warrior. So, I hope you understand the reason for actions. Yeah, yeah, of course. I'm so grateful for your display of honor. Oh, kind nobles. I would appreciate if you didn't speak that way. Enough, enough. My negotiations were going along just fine. Look what happened. You broke into the situation you had no idea about, and your partner ended up getting hurt. I was a. Sir. Sir. Find a way out. Focus on what matters. Hey, hey. Oh, who is there? Hey, you. Trying to open the gate? Yeah. No use trying, mate. The last guy locked in have tried doing the same. It's funny. They work like a, like a little chicken. It's like... Aren't they humans? Why do they walk like they are uh, hunched over so hard? Do, 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 I, do they all have like back pain? Boss told me to come and thank you. Your ship's so pretty, we're taking extra care of each part we're removed. Don't touch Khan! Once we sell the parts, I reckon we don't have to work for at least half a year. Really appreciate it, mate. Don't touch it! Don't touch it now. And that fake witch over there. No need to blame the guy. You wouldn't have made it out either way. Maybe they're hybrid. I don't know. I don't know. No station. In, uh, in Opus, everybody's pretty human. There are no aliens or nothing. I think they're just, you know. Uh, maybe they're cosplaying. <laughs> they're just cosplaying birds. 
Like they, they're full into the act, full into the act. They forget that they can walk up straight. Even if the boss uh, let you go, the rest of us wouldn't. Not for a self-proclaimed witch. Ida is definitely aiming her. When the boss isn't looking, you'll see. All right, Junli. We have to do something better, boy. I'm fine. I'm sorry. I was a little too harsh. I was just frustrated. No worries, we're gonna get you out. Come on, Ida. Do something. Uh, give me a moment. Thank you for the heart. Ooh, Remy, you're back. Keep it down, I'm fine, but I'm a bit in the trouble here. Don't worry. We'll just stick to plan C. So we're going down the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. <laughs> going lower with the plants. Fortunately, they had to, they had, they had the decency not to search my body. I'll contact you later. Come on, Ida. <laughs> hey, did you? Huh? What? Ah, oh, Keep my communication device. Did a good job hiding it. What is this? What do you mean? What is this? Hold on. That's not just a communication device. It was used on United Mining Lumen seeking vessels during the war by. <coughs> Who are you? A soldier? What did you find in case? I didn't understand anything she said, but it sounded beautiful. I'm just a prisoner like you, and I plan to get out. It doesn't matter what the Japanese people say, everything sounds beautiful. She could be telling to me that she's going to murder and kill me, and uh, put me in a little box and send me off to the ocean, but it will be sounding so sweet. I totally say, like, yes, please, it sounds beautiful. I don't understand what you're saying, but it's beautiful. <laughs> no need to be worried. I assure you that you were on the same side. Who are you talking to? Thank you for the hearts, everybody. The other person you met at the market. My pilot, she's very reliable. You mentioned a plan C, what is it? My escape plan. Wow, June. <laughs> I love this guy. He's a noble, he's tra being trained to be a master, a clan master. He has a, um, like an ex super soldier next to him with a lot of experience. And now he's going like, oh, did you have a plan? Oh shit, I forgot about a plan. We didn't come inside this cave with a plan. Plan A was rescue the girls. Plan B, C, D, E, N, F, G, no plan, just plan A, just plan A, this, this, this is a one track mind, one track guy, we just go A, we just save girls, whatever happens, we don't care. He's not a bit unprepared, he's completely unprepared, he's just, but you know what, I like it, because his plan is A, save the girls, but the plan is still ongoing. See, he didn't change the plan. It's still plan A. He's still going to save the girls. So, uh, he just didn't think of plan B. It's just A all the way. Only half a plan, actually. I just didn't want to worry her. Oh, wow, that sounded very interesting. What about the other half? I'm not sure yet. Let me think a bit. Military vocalizer, a communication device hidden beneath Ida's hair, which also has the ability to adjust one's timbre. It was used to assist soldiers with injured throats. Afterwards, I found out that Bones hadn't confiscated it partially out of sympathy and partially because of confidence that no one would encounter encroach on his territory. Military vocalizer. Okay, buddy, let's pop it. 
Activate it once more. It's not gonna work. We know. Oh God. Hey! Are you done with the gate? Even if you did open it. We have guys guys on the other side too, so just give up. Alright, 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 alright. Ida, we do have to start talking. Okay. How are you doing, buddy? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Please, okay, sir. I need to get him out. Do you have any ideas? Mm. Mm. How well do you perform? You saw me try, I couldn't open the gate. You saw me try, I couldn't open the gate. If you need a better song, I can record one for you. We should be near the center of a cave. So I'll see what I can hear. When I start singing, all you need to do is point your synthesizer recorder towards me. How is that possible? Be careful. She could be a real witch. During the war, their ability to sense Lumen allowed them to seek out caves and other ships, making them effective human radars. Is that what you say to the person who cheated your wounds? Don't associate me with the witches of war. I'm a witch of the Red Chamber. I focus on cultivating my soul, not becoming an instrument of war. I know what you're thinking. If I can produce the star songs, why don't I just open the gate myself? But that's not what I need. Opening medium gates requires a vocal technique that some witches possess. Unfortunately, my throat isn't capable of it. Do you trust me? May we begin? I trust that you're an honorable person. What does the saying have to do with honor? Let the... Ready for karaoke. Let's go. Follow the lyrics. And do your best, Ida. I can't sing very loudly. <sighs> Chills. Oh my God. That was the star song this asteroid. The sample should allow you to open the gate. Wow, beautiful. Oh my God, this... Oh, it's a beautiful song. Oh my God, it hits me every time. It hits me every time. Wispy Witch Star Song, a sample of Ida's voice when we first met. It was faint, as if it has been damaged, but her voice, oh, it was so beautiful, I'll never forget it. Oh my god, guys, I don't know if I am going to cry again. That was beautiful. It's nothing. So now we can open the gate, what's next? It is magical, Stacia, it didn't sound magical, it is magical. That's even, uh, that's where the missing half comes in. Even if we do open the gate, I don't know how we can sneak past them. Unless there's someone, uh, some way to distract them. Oh, we got an idea. I have an idea. I can offer them a ship to let us go. I need some way to connect my ship. We can't open the gate and just run for it. We can open the gate and run. No, 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 I can offer them a ship. No, no. I need some way to connect to my ship, let's do this. The signals of the ocean ship should be easy enough to filter, but how will you control it if it's not activated? I can hear the engines, they definitely activate my ship. Once the gates open, I can give you the ship's access code. I can fly it around to distract them. So, let's uh, click on the first one. I don't remember what I clicked in the past, so let's go with the first option. Are you serious? 
It's worth pursuing. Let's go, let's go. Right, this actually could work. This is outrageous, sir. Kai, sit still. You're bleeding out, buddy. I'm doing this to save your butt. Your crew member, the pilot, is she, is she ready for this? She's already standby. In a moment, she'll enter the port and pretend to be a cargo ship in distress. She looks very young, is that safe? No worries. She grew up dealing with pirates. What about you? You should know that there is no guarantee that this will work. Are you really willing to do this? Yes. How could I lose? The boy tried to open the gate before comprehending its frequency. Ha! Much too impulsive! From which clan is he? He belongs to Lee, that insignificant clan which the mining rights to Shinmen and Chianyi. The clan that failed negotiations with United Mining and was driven off Thousand Peaks. No one. Your Majesty, it was an unfair competition. My opponent had the inscriptions memorized beforehand. I had no choice but to rush. Be quiet, sir. Your Majesty, the young master of Lee questions your judgment. Please forgive me, Your Majesty. My young master is not good with words. He implied no such thing. Kai, this is my responsibility. Watch yourselves! Both of you, step back! Please forgive my failure to discipline my people, your majesty. I placed my trust in you, clan master. Issued a verdict. At 12 o'clock standard time, 351-0340 of this East Ocean calendar, the 16th heir of the Lee clan entered the match for the mining rights of that Hong. Disgusting game of nobles, guys. I understand why nobles are not liked. This was all politics, mischief, plots, disgusting, dirty plans behind the curtains. As the cosmos bear witness, the match is concluded with the defeat of Lee. Therefore, the mining rats for Datong will be revoked for the 16 hair. <laughs> In addition, the Lee clan committed further offense by questioning the results of the match. And as such, the Lee clan mining rights to all great one caves, including Shinmen, Yinshan, and Xianjia, are henceforth revoked. Effective immediately. See, this was all plotted beforehand. Your Majesty, please. Revoking your mining rights will deprive the clan of its livelihood. You should learn to keep your people in check, clan master. The defeat suffered here today pales in comparison to the recklessness action we have witnessed. For this, the Lee clan will have always be inferior. So, Lee messed up. 
and now Master. he's going to uh, trying to what he said it's honor are you all right I'm fine Stay focused, my pilot has just entered the port. She's pretending to negotiate with them right now. If we take any longer, they might ask her to open the cabin. Let's go, let's go. Open the gate when you're ready. We're running out of time. Let's go, open the gate to victory! Woo! Wispy, wispy with star song. Let's go, pop it, boy. Use your uh, karaoke scepter. There we go. Gate is responding. I can start the performance. All right, boy. Before we start, I just like to reintroduce myself. My name is Idalun. It's a beautiful name, guys. I loved it in the past. I still love it. Idalun. Very beautiful name. Of the Red Chamber Trading Vessel. It's a pleasure to meet you, Noble. Call me Jun. Third rank Noble of Lee. Ninth of the East Ocean Clans. What do you guys think of Idalun? Beautiful name or not? Drop it down in the comments. <laughs> Stasia, what are you writing? It's indeed a beautiful anime. Anime. It's a beautiful anime. <laughs> typos every day. Typos, typos. <laughs> this man is Kei, my guardian, whom I shared my life and death. Mary and Everlasting. Thank you for offering to do this. To make it out alive, I owe you my life. I need no such thing. Oh my god, if you think about it, that's a pretty hard statement. He says, I will give you my life, and she says, like, Ew, ah, I don't need such a thing. Like, ah, ah. keep that thing for yourself. I don't need no uh, life. Uh, keep that for yourself. Disgusting. Uh. Disinfect that before you give it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Kai. But those pirates will leave you to die. I must save you. Please. Uh, this isn't worth it. We're all set. As soon as the gate opens, my pilot will send a signal to your ship. Focus. Concentrate on the star song. Use left, right to adjust the star song. Up and down for the volume. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, I love this piece. Guys, turn up your volume. I love this mythical voice. This is the sound that she hears from the lumen inside the asteroid. I love the idea. Let's resonate. May East Ocean Greet you return. She's in your hands now. Remy! Access code is... May... I'm sorry, Kun. Ooh, yes, yeah, Stasia, Sirens. Indeed, something like this. Like a beautiful mythical voice. BOOM! Now! Let's go, Kai! Run, boy, run! Let's go! Ho! Save the booties! Mirian Gate. Within the Mirian Shrine, to separate the lower and higher deities, only the gods that could chant the inscriptions on the massive gate were allowed to come and go. We keep on walking. We keep on walking. <laughs> Eddie, it worked! Use myself to the ship and the boom! Remy sounds too happy. She sounds way too happy to blow up a ship. I know how you managed to find an ocean ship, but damn, I felt good. She just destroyed a full ship. Everyone is at the port, it's going nuts, this is your chance! We have to hurry, my pilot is ready! And we keep walking! Oh, let's go on walking! Let's go! Woo! Woo! Left! 
Right, left, right, left, 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 right, 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 right. Go, go. I love this scene. It was pretty epic. I'm at port six. I'm at I'm at the port ramp six. Good. Forgive me. Oh, he blew up his ship, his noble ship. I do understand. Whoa! I do understand. Okay, are you alright? Go get him! I wanna say. I do understand how it feels to lose a ship or something or a car. Let's go, boy. Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up, pick him up. let's go. Your boys better be ducking. Bullet's gonna be flying. Woo! Keep going! Dark boys! Ah! Woo! Woo! Yeah! We're getting shot! Move! Girl, don't stand there! Move! Where is your pilot? There! Watch out! What is the ship? Good lumen. That's a lumen resource scanner. It's a United Mining Lumen Seeking Vessel. Empty those things from the market! Remy, no time for talking! Hey, don't come near ship! Where are the people you're bringing, Eddie? Let him on board, Remy! Yeah, yeah, honky there! No time to explain, they're coming for us! Hurry up! Boys and girls, you're being blasted by bullets! Bones Brigade Base, Escape Passage, Red Chamber Bridge. Get signals locked on. Emergency takeoff! Woohoo! Oh, I love it! Epic scene, epic ship. Nice movie. Mm. Go save to 31%. Don't come near the flight deck! <laughs> come on, guys. Stay breathing, boy. We'll be there soon. Grab onto something. Boys! Hug each other! They should be thrown in the airlock and ejected. Remy, please. Prepare for hyper travel. Calculating velocity. Locating destination. Destination located. Traveling. Hyperdrive in. Four. Three. Two. One. Engines. Uh oh. What's wrong? Hyperdrive failed. The engine is overheating. Come on, Remy. You can do this. She's a good pilot. She's a badass girl. Remy. This never happened to the red engines. Were the engine damaged on the way out? I don't know. You, you're the pilot. Remy, you're a badass pilot. Hey, which? This is a lumen seeking vessel, isn't it? Okay, you have to sit still. I don't know who you kids got the ship, but listen. Don't tell us what to do with our ship! Listen, damn it! I know how to fix this. These are support vessels for seeking out the enemy. If you enter hyper travel right after takeoff, it will lock up the engines. You'll need to override the ship's authorization levels. Give this to the witch, Jun. Hyper travel instructions. I still remember the startled look, look on Ida's face when Kai scribbled the instructions on the piece of paper I handed to her. She never would have thought that the ocean's guardian who stood beside them was a seasoned Lumen War veteran. Of course he is. What do you expect? Give the note. Override. Of course this will fix it, Ida. Trust the boy, Kay. Hyperspeed enabled. It worked! The engines are back up! Ooh, I'm getting chills from this scene. Preparing for hyper travel! Warning! We've been locked on! Oh, they're blasting us! We're being shot! Ooh. 
Your wounds. Can you handle acceleration? Do it. You're full of blood. You've already lost 700 liters. How you're still alive? You're a freaking Terminator. You're a zombie. Three. It's June, right? Sorry for the things I said to you. Earlier. Thank you for saving me. Two. Woo! Let's go! Let's go! One! Nice! Escaped! Oh yeah! Woo! Oh. Somebody tell me who these people are! I love it, it's really like a movie! I love it! It's good! It's good, I appreciate it! Chapter 2, Part 1 Yes, it's good. Oh my god, it feels so nice to relive the memories, really relive the story with full action, with full audio, full voice acting. The story of Ida goes further back, long before I met her. 66 years ago. As factions from across the galaxy fought for dominance, the Lumen War raged on with no end in sight. Eventually, Eventually the United Mining Corporation approached one of the Thousand Peaks religious factions, the Witching Tower. That sounds pretty badass, the Witching Tower. United Mining promised to put an end to the conflict and to ensure the religious legitimacy of the Witching Tower. They signed a contract with the tower and enlisted the help of the witches, servants of the faith who cultivated the ability to communicate with spirits. Their ability to sense the lumen energy made them indispensable on the battlefield. Once emissaries of God, they were now the harbingers of death. Worse yet, as the war came to an end, United Mining grew fearful of the Myrian religion, rising influence. Classic. Not only did they denounce the Witching Tower, they refused to compensate them for the service as they had promised. By swaying public opinion, to condemn the tower involvement in the war, they drove the witches out of Thousand Peaks. Within years, within years, witching towers influence was all gone to the doom to the doom and the witches were blamed to the doom to the doom for the war to the doom forcing them to the doom to conceal identities to the doom and flee I love the drums I want to do like a dance around the fire on his music. <laughs> However, despite their fall from grace, their natural ability to seek out Lumen allowed them to remain active in the shadows. Oh, yeah. Mm. In the eyes of the cave runners, they were invaluable companions. But to the victim of war, they were nothing but the war machines. Hmm. Miko 
一番心の支えになったのはヘイダだった。Yet no matter how the others saw them, Ida remained my greatest consolation during my years in exile. Guys, I'm totally not ready for the whole game anymore. I'm not ready. Yeah, yeah, override data. Let's go. Six standard hours after escaping the Bones Brigade. Trading post, Mayfair. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you so much. Thank you for following the live streams. We've got、uh, five people today. It's wonderful. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate everybody who、uh, pops into the chat to follow the game. A bit of a silent situation over there. Stay away from a fly deck! You shouldn't even be allowed on the w i t c h e r ship! Please accept them, Remy. These people saved me. Ida, I'm very grateful for your help, but I don't, I don't need to be accepted. Oh, yeah? And why don't you take your servant and leave? He's my guardian. Don't you dare speak of him like that. Good lumen, sir. Show some maturity. <laughs> Right? That's enough. We're all on this together. We shouldn't be fighting. Remy, is communication back online? Not even close. It's completely busted. Usually it wouldn't be an issue, but we don't have any spare parts around. Thank you for the. Thank you. Thank you, Stacia. Very kind words. Thank you so much. Well, this area we're in now was a battleground. Maybe we can find something in the wreckages. <laughs> <laughs> okay, are you alright?、Uh, tell you what, Noble. You want to find a doctor for your sir? Guardian, Remy. Guardian. Of course. If you help us do some scavenging, I suppose we can find you a doctor. What? Don't take advantage of people's injuries. Hey, people should pay for their, for their stay. Don't listen to her. We'll find you a doctor no matter what. Agree for the sake of K. You save this, of course I'll help. I can help, and I trust you that you will uphold your promise. See, honorable as always. Ah, this is wrong. I guess they can stay for a bit. It's not like they're gonna be here for long. If Jen doesn't mind, I can get to work now,、uh, but the wreckages here are、uh, mostly from the war, so I'll need an exploration kit. Tell them where the kits are, Remy. Trading post Mayfair. What I remember most about being on the run when arguing with Remy every day. Ah, what I remember most about being on the run was arguing with Remy every day. Now that I've gotten older, I really miss that. Oh, that's so sweet. Broken communication module. Broken communication module. After the war, the airspace in Thousand Peaks was fully of unidentifiable electromagnetic waves sent out by communication modules scattered throughout space, making space travel full of. Well, English just got unpredictable risks. That's what I want to say. Did you find anything? I did, but please give me more time. I saw some other things that might be useful. Let's go explore some more. We've got five more kits. Broken communication module again. This is all I could find. Okay, see, on top we have got like、uh, fuel, seven on ten, four of six armor plating. And four of six exploration kit in 2400. Money, 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 money. I love money so much. Not bad. I'll fix the ship in seconds. Looks like we have enough materials to upgrade the ship. Yeah, upgrade.、Uh, look what the oceaners did to my precious ship. Excuse me, Remy. You just blew up our ship. You just made a big kaboom. The communication of the communication, the connection, <laughs> the communication of the communication, uh, brain fart. The connection of the communications module should be around here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Communication module. Confirm upgrade. Boom. Communication is back online. Perfect. System rebooting. Opus O3 Lumen seeking vessels. Assistive AI rebooting. Greetings, Master Remy. I don't know why he sounds like that, but I'm pretty sure that's how the AI sounds. Took you long enough.、Uh, can I upgrade? Oh, yeah, I want to upgrade some more. Oh, yeah. 
Oh yeah. Oh, we don't have a mine biochip. We don't have this. We don't have this. We don't have this. We got nothing. This is now what we need. All right. We cannot explore anymore. So uh, yeah, sure. Let's um, go to navigation. And uh, ooh, we got some messages. View now. Red chamber bounty. Oh no, we've got a uh, greetings, fellow peeps of the belt. My ignis shine upon your good deeds. This is the bones of the bones brigade with a bounty on the following person. We've got a Jun K. We've got a witch and a pilot. Alrighty, boys. Good luck. Good hunting. Forty thousand credits. Good luck. Good night. Okay. Yep. Download the photo. Ooh, we look kind of good on the bounty photo. We've got a picture for Ida. Uh. We need help. We're hiding somewhere in the ruins of the war, but the fuel is running low. Ida, you are in big trouble. I saw the bounty on you and your friends before I even received them. Oh, I want to hear her voice, by the way. Oh, I'm so curious. I will not voice act. Well, just, uh, you know, read over it. The attachment includes a bit coordinates of the Griefang. Uh, there's been a lot of gang fights in the area recently, so we changed uh, our orbit as a security measure. I trust you can find us. Dr. Russell, Lumen Associate, head of the Guifang branch. Oh yes, let's get the coordinates. Thank you. Dr. Russell was always nagging about us sometimes. But some... Uh, about... Blah, 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 blah. Dr. Russell was always nagging us about something. But sometimes I really miss her. Back. Perfect, we got new coordinates. Uh, S. Guifang. That's gonna be there. Okay, so we can travel and do a lot of stuff. I still remember this. We can, for example, go here. We'll lose three. We'll still have four few left. And then we can uh, go towards here as well. We also have an abnormal singer here. But you know, our boy is almost dying. So uh, let's fly straight to safety. Is this where we went last time? The spectrum analysis doesn't look right. No big deal. This can be easily analyzed. Analyze. Resupply facility available. Lumen War Relief Foundation. Travel. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Alright, Jun. Once we reach Gifang, your guardian injuries will finally be properly treated. Don't blame us if it doesn't work out enough. Remy, don't. Dr. Russell was, was a military doctor during the war, but now she helps out at the Lumen Association. She handles everything from mining related injuries to mining right applica applications. She's very reliable. Sure. Thank you for helping us. Not at all, my master used to say, a witch must save oneself in order to save others. Eddie, I'm getting unidentified signals from the ships ahead. Looks like a bounty hunter. You the people listen on the bounty? You got nerve from the hell you raised with that trash ship of yours. Soon enough, now, and we can get over with it, and don't you try anything funny. Well, I will not try anything funny. But do you know why the bike fell down? Because it was too tired. <laughs> yep. They cracked it. Our signal modification didn't work. Why did it fail? Ah, Red Chamber is an old ship after all. If we could upgrade the signal modifier, we'd have a better chance. The old signal modifier failed to convince them. They immediately saw through the trick and responded with a barrage of attacks. Pew, 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 pew. Although they managed to escape, Red Chamber took quite a few hits. We have gotten... How many? Two plates off. Ooh, we are two armor plates. That hurt. Veteran abode Guifang. I heard this place was established by soldiers who were injured or crippled in the Lumen War. It is here where I met the doctor. Doctor! Members of the association came from all backgrounds, but most of them were veterans from the war. The amount of Lumen intel in their hands came only second to United Mighty. Still very young. Young voice she has. I think she has just been, you know, damaged by war and grief and everything she's seen. Sorry. I was only able to give him uh, emergency treatment. His injuries are worse than expected. So will Kai? I'll be able to walk, but uh, hyper travel has caused internal injuries, which need to be examined further. Hanzai 
Unfortunately, there were some gang fights over uh, a mining dispute last week, so we're low medical supplies and prosthetics. It'll take at least a standard week for new supplies to reach this rural situation. Station. You can get immediately treatment at Iron Wing Central Hospital if you're willing to risk crossing the asteroid belt. Or you can sit and wait, uh, this isn't much of a choice. Worst case scenario, he ends up in a pr uh, prosthesis. Plenty of agents here uh, get by in wheelchairs. I'm sure he'll get used to it. Forgive me, but for an ocean warrior, there would be no difference from death. Who is this man, Ada? I'm... I was speaking to Ada, young man. He and this injured man saved my life. <sighs> Always getting yourself in trouble, just like your master. You, go out. I need to speak with Ida. I wish you side beside Kate. If you want to save him, leave now. It will be fine, Jun. Dr. Russell is a close friend. So, was that your level? She knows! She knows! Women with experience instantly see when there is a spark going on. What? Of course not. That's what I thought, Ida. I've told you many times you need to stop searching for Lumen Caves. I'm not here to talk about this, Doctor. <笑>そんなことになったら死者を似合わせる顔がなくなるぞ If you keep this up, you're going to get yourself and your crew killed one day. What would your master think of me if I allowed this to happen? 先生、私を流脈協会に入れて Let me join the Lumen Association, Doctor. 流脈は諦めなさい Give up, Ida. じゃあ、功労の軍事用設定データを私に返して Give, then give me back Red Chamber's military configurations. You shouldn't even try flying a military vessel. Then at least help us, please. Don't be stubborn like your master, Ida. Take a look at these injuries. Your decision to enter Hyper Travel was, oh, has only made it even worse. Fine, I'll figure it out by myself. Oi! 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 Sayonara! Sayonara, Doctor! Wakata, Wakata! Wakata, Wakata! Oh, Guanai, Guaju, Wajanai. There is another option as well. Yes, what is it? Nothing ever changed my mind. Does it? Why are you two always like this? Wait for my message, I'll send the details. Stay out of trouble, will ya? Not so fast. You're going to go cave running, at least resupply your ship. Yes, please. I will resupply the ship. Give me armor. Bye. If you want to pick some more, I'll try and ch charge you 800 for 8 of them. Try to stock up when can. Yes, 800. Bye. Buy and bulk. Thank you. Fuel. Yes, buy and bulk. Uh, what is this? Lumen coating. Wanna be an asteroid belt hero? Highly dribble against attacks. Takes effect in just half standard hour. What is this? Lumen coating. Uh, it's locked. Well, let's get some exploration stuff. Perfect. We are stocked up. Can we sell some stuff? Didn't we collect some uh, random uh, lumen uh, stuff in the cave? No? No, probably not because we, we had to go running. I want nothing, Doc, anymore. Thank you very much. Hope you saved the doctor. Many residents of the Asteroid Belt were displaced, displaced by United Mining. Even if there wasn't a bounty on you, people won't be too happy to see a witch ship. 
Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Well... Most of Gu Feng's residents were crippled veterans who were abandoned after the war. They set up the foundation hoping to provide a place for those who had nowhere to go. They hated outsiders though, especially those looking for Lumen. After all, they're the one who started the damn war. <laughs> you from Prosthetic Energy? Our scrappers here are itching to get to work. That shipment of excavation arms here yet or what? Aha. Uh -huh. Good, 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 good. I still remember. So whenever we fly, travel and do some stuff, we can find here and there some, you know, items or some extra work to get some cash. Mary and Everlasting, may Helios blessings be upon you. Children who lost their families to the war ended up in this place like this. The children were often forced into labor and the place was frequented by human traffickers. There was no warmth to be found here. Remy abhorred this place. You're cave runners, aren't you? Please, could you spare us some credits? Ida, we must help these children. Just ignore them. Kids like these are everywhere in the peaks. Any credits you give them, just go straight to the bosses. Peekers should look for another way. If it's a scam, then so be it. 400. I am going to give, not give. I don't remember what did in the past, but uh, Remy's right. Let's go. Ida turned around and left without a word. I suppose that was her choice. Okay. Okay, so. What do we gotta do? We gotta do what we gotta do, I guess. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta go through our emails first. Don't tell anyone I did this for you. Ida, this is your only option. Assuming you can find the cave, I've attached directions to a nearby Lumen cave registered under the association. This place produces rare medical herbs. Since you're red pupil, you should be familiar with lumen plants. Find me a handful of Lyra's Kasami. It's an uh, exceptionally rare plant that can repair cellular damage. Bring it back with the injured man and I'll figure something out. To be clear, I shouldn't be giving you out. I shouldn't be giving this out to non-association members, even if your reds adopt a daughter. Dr. Russell. Thank you. Key directions. Registered cave, Ida said that during the last that during the years they spent searching for a master, the doctor always watched out for them. Doc's always the same. Assuming you find the cave. Her practically she practically gave us the location. Get ready, Remy. Is your throat alright? Why worry? If you have, I have you and the red chamber to help me. Can you really locate lumen caves? With just a vague sense of direction? Not for normal people, but the witch can. What? You don't like my voice? Too late. So you really are a witch. Just like I said. You were... A human reader? Disqualified. 103. 108. 113. These members will be removed from level 5 as of today, revoking their witch candidacy. Oh, it's Yon Ida. She looks so cute. Don't be disheartened, 108. Even at level 4, you will still be allowed to engage in the tower's affairs. After two years, this is how she ended up. I thought she was gifted. The girl is saying she is incurable, her voice will deteriorate when she gets older. Eventually, she'll no longer be able to make a sound without singing techniques. Shh, she's coming. Why should I? She used to act like she was so much smarter than us. Hey liar, I thought you said you could handle anything. What are you going to do now? You still can't make it to our level. Hey, be quiet during the ritual. A witch who can't sing, ha <laughs> ha. Silence. There will be no such behavior in the tower. You think you're so smart, but you'll never be a witch. Yes, but I would rather be called a witch, not a human reader. Got it, apologies. Let's pop these coordinates. Let's go here. Sure, abandoned cave signal. Analyzing. Uh, is this the one? Or not the one? Analyze. Enable to analyze. Lumen sensor scanning is sufficient. Aha. Uh -huh. We have not sufficient scanning powers. All right, but uh, sure, London Trade Alliance. Let's go there, I guess. Fly, fly, fly. Fly, fly, fly. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have insisted in coming to Thousand Peaks. This place is not meant for us. 
Sir, we investigated every solar system that allowed private ownership of Lumen Caves and listened to the sound of each star system. You chose Thousand Peaks. But what if I made a mistake? A leader should not easily doubt their own decision. The star must have a reason for telling you where to go. We East Oceanus are seekers of Lumen. Whatever it is, there will be our people. It's the star song of Thousand Peaks. Is the one that you cannot forget, then it is where you where your fate the lumen lies. Find the lumen, young master, and bring prosperity to the clan. Oh yeah. A man of sense and duty and mission. Lumen gave Great Benjamin. At the beginning of our Thousand Peaks adventure, Kai and I had no choice but to run around scavenging whatever we could. He would go on about history of Lumen War and how Thousand Peaks was torn apart by several fractions. Let's do some explorations. What did we find? Some hybrid luminum, luminum shards. Luminite shards, the hard luminite ore found in the depths of caves, varies so much in purity. The sound frequencies it produces that it's difficult to use as a digital fuel. Instead, since lumen is worshipped by the people, it tends to be used for artistic or ceremonial purposes. Alright, alright, alright. Let's explore some more. Some more of this. Alright. We have uh, found some more fuel, which is pretty interesting. Hybrid aluminum. Okay, we're done here. Let's continue on scavenging. We should be close. Entering identification and passcode. Permission verified. QBC OPS03 Lumen Seeking Vessel Bio Amplification Scanner activated. Synchronization Ida Loon. Vocal tuning complete. Initiating Lumen Rezo Scanner. I want to press the scanner. Press it. Oh, that sounds nice. There we go, guys. Suspected star song at the Oh, there she goes. That's the most epic karaoke ever. Imagine having such a big karaoke machine. Sing softly. Find the star song that resonates with my voice. Oh yes, yes, I, w I will. No. Oh, I can listen to her voice for hours. That's just hypnotizing. Wow, they gave me the chills, my hairs are standing up. Although Ida said her throat was damaged, and that she struggled with certain vocal techniques, this star song was unlike the one I recorded when I first met her. It was grandiose and bright, as if she was conjuring myths through an ancient hymn. Wow. Which star song analyze complete, setting navigations to origin of star song? Room scanning complete. Zoof. Primordial cave signals. Travel. Scanning, scanning, scanning. Scanning complete. Travel. Only one fuel cost. That's good. We don't have to keep up with everything. This is it. This is the place. We made it. You. Shouldn't you be happy, Noble? Um, thank you. Now it's your turn. I'm not good at cave running. Here, take this. What is this? My voice. I'm an East Ocean runner. We have our own way of producing sound. I heard you use Daddy's voice to escape the prison. That was different. Just take it as a backup for the sake of your companion. And take this as well. You aren't familiar with Lumen plants, are you? Things like Lyra Kasami and such. This egg. Echo scanner will help you identify plants that grow in the cave. I hope Kay gets treated soon. Thank you all. Not at all. I'm already familiar with these plants, and the ship has more than enough storage space. If you bring back extra plants, we can sell them for a decent price, so it's fair. Obtained Echo scanner. Ira's knowledge of lumen plants far surpassed my imagination. Once she even asked me to take the Echo scanner and test her, I could. It could identify hundreds of plants. But she just say, it's basic witch knowledge. That's a, 
that's pretty um it's a flex that's a flex of all the caves i've encountered perhaps this one is the hardest to forget Lumen Cave Asteroid 819. Okay, can you hear me? Onse, Kriyo. Mondai Nego. Onse, clear. Ramia to watch the back up, Sirkara. Nanika at the Sugo Shetene. Remina on standby, let us know if we need. Kai. Kaito. Sweet Ekonai Hoga. You shouldn't have come with me, Kai. Waka no goe koso. Waga nimbus. My job is to protect you from harm, sir. <coughs> How are you supposed to protect me? Like this, go back to the ship. It's fine. I'm feeling better already. Doctor had a bad attitude, but she's good at what she does. See? I can walk just fine. Stop pushing yourself. You need my help, sir. My god. Is this Lirika Sami? Let's check it, boy. No, this is potted lilax. Whatever the wind blows, the tiny bits of luminite in the stem and crack and flitter away as the rest of the flower wilts. Given that it is used as a farewell flower, the demand for it on the market is rather large. That's how we'd explain it. But Ida says they grow closer to the center of the asteroid. Well, let's go to the center of the asteroid, my boy. My boy, let's go where we need to go then, if you know where we need to go. Potted Lilax, what the hell is this? The Lumen Cave is only open to cave runners with academic permits. Yeah, sure, we definitely got academic permit. Wispy, grandiose, switch a star song. Oh, yeah. Let's use our beautiful voice. Wonderful, really wonderful. See? I can open gaze myself. Mm. Mm. Well done, sir. Well, there is so much lore, so much story to this. There is deeper meaning. Even to this, very every single second we use the lumen, there is a lot of meaning, guys. I definitely advise you, if you, if you are interested in this game, you can play it yourself and read all the bits and the lore. So you can watch my first ever through playthrough. I've done a lot of reading there as well. Looks like the stone pipes are destroyed by vegetation. No, I really mean it. There's so much lore. But we will definitely understand everything as we play the game, so no worries. You can definitely understand this playthrough, everything that was happening. We need to look around for some other way into the shrine. I told you not to worry. Let me handle this. So, uh, there is really, really a lot of lore. And if not clear, you can drop a comment down below and I'll try to explain a little bit. But I also had to, uh, also needed a little bit of uh, guidance and, you know, reading to understand it better. But the concept is really cool what they created here. Really nice concept of lumen and uh, space travel and all this architecture and designs. Really magnificent. <laughs> So, grandiose witch's song. Open up the next gate. Why isn't Ida's voice working? The star song came from what she heard thousands of kilometers away. Any flaw in her singing could render it useless. Should I ask Ida for help? She can record another song here. Experience runners don't need to rely on witches. Follow me. This is an abundant cave, so it shouldn't be hard to find. Aye, aye, Captain, I'm following you. Let's go. Oh, yeah. There's a pool of luminite. Let's see from the ground. It may not be as pure. But it should be enough for a decent performance over the Stick your synth scepter in and see what it samples. Sure, 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 sure. Let's put a scepter inside some juice. Another bell. Thank you. 
Dropping it in, taking samples. Deep star song. You like Ida's voice. The star song that came through the ground was deep and resounding, while the vibrations of liquid that traveled into my hand felt ancient and full of sorrow. However, the sound quality was somewhat choppy. See? You don't need a witch for this. Try performing with that sample. Aye, aye, Captain. We are gonna go and perform with that sample specifically. Let's go, let's go. So, deep star song. Ooh, that is just a deep hum. Very deep hum. I don't like it's really a, a sorrow song. It's like thousands of cries. You're getting better at this young master. Of course I am. You're a great teacher, Kay. Mm hmm What is this? It's a broken pipeline, buddy. So what it is, don't you see? Ah. Uh, I remember the first time I started training you, you've grown a lot. Now's not the time, how do we get past this? Relax, there's just a leakage in the pipe. Cut off the luminite. Sure. Whatever, let's use the Deep Star song. Since it's from here, it's like a master key for everything. There we go, problem solved. Not bad for a second, Kavron. You worry too much. No, no, Jun, you're doing really good. Found something? It looks like something from East Ocean. Must have been left by some other runner. Don't worry about it. Peculiar charm, even though the oceaners were known to get where the lumen was and for many generations settled in the solar systems, at the time I didn't understand what the charm really represented. Peculiar charm. Climbing up, climbing up and climbing up, sure. Let's go up we go. No worries, Kay, I got this. Looks like this is as far as they can go. Don't try following me, get back to the ship. This of course. I'm not going to climb that. What are you doing? I'll send you back to the ship, then I'll come back. No need. I'll carry you if you can't walk. Ah, uh, good Lumen, give me a break. Don't you have to follow me around? You're injured. Are you two alright? Your signals aren't moving. Hey, Miko. Hey, witch. Each crew member has vital striker, right? Tell them how my vitals look right now. It looks like you've recovered 7.2% since you left the ship. Good lumen. I didn't know caves could heal like that. That's all I need to know, thank you. Stop joking around. Remember what I always say, sir. Think before you act. Take one step at a time. And one day, you'll be the clan master. Where are you going with this? What are you doing? Give me your hand. This isn't time for that. By the honor of the Lee clan. Don't bring that up now. By the honor. Of the Lee clan. Fine. I, Cave Olin, hereby swear to protect Jun with my life. I shall not waver in my duties, and I will forever be his shield. 
<笑>でも、待たないといけないじゃないか。ごめんくださいシップナウ。流脈探査では強がりは厳禁。どんぶしよ。ドアンプッシュ<笑><笑> I'm heading back. Lie down as soon as you get back, okay? Alright, let's start climbing. He can get back to his ship on his own. He's a big boy. Big boy, big muscles, big beard! If you got a big beard, you can get back to the ship. It's been an honor chaining you, master. Go back to the ship, buddy. All about honor, 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 honor. Alright, what do we have here? We've got a gate which we need to open. We've got one of the pipes with the keys. We've got uh, the engine here. So let's uh, pop that open. So we can start evaporating the gas. The lumen into the gas. Alright, there's gonna be what? Just like two fine tunings. There we go. Something like this should do it. We only need to hit two keys or two notes. The gas is flowing. Boy, better run. Transmutation chamber. Water winds. Water winds the wind and wind will birth a song. Lumen is a particularly stable and is not affected by increases increased heat. However, it does react to certain frequencies which converts it from liquid to gas while emitting a resounding below. This peculiar process is known as transmutation and the sound is referred as a star song. Got it. Got it. Pop open the master key and let's go. Doo -doo. I love it how these engines and pipelines fill. These ancient gods or civilization were really pretty musical, I love it. The inscription of Miriam Valves are like a small Miriam gate. They used to direct the flow of the lumen and a whole contraption, their part, are known as lumen transmutation engines. They're really nice, but how did a full civilization like this just cease to, cease to exist? That's the biggest question of all. Snowy Sunherb, it is said that the gods would inhale lumen to extend their lives. That's backed by science, you know. Ida told me the lumen plants found in Thousand Peaks were used for a variety of medical purposes. That's what it is. They lived for thousands and thousands of years. That's what they did. They were immortal. Is that the shrine? That looks like... A shrine. Okay. This place is amazing. What? Are there ancient spirits? Stop joking. Tell me what you see. I'm not sure how to describe it, but I see lights everywhere. That's the lumen. It sounds like you've reached the deepest part of the shrine. Mirian god Helios. In Mirian mythology, Helios was the remaining star stuffed left over sta What? Helios was the remaining star stuff left over from Ignis' fiery creation of the world. Having inherited some of Ignis' power, he is the second only to Ignis, the god of gods. The god of gods. The Lumen Cave was discovered by the Rodin family, the earliest pioneers of Thousand Peaks. It has since then been donated to the for academic researchers. Perfect. Your academic research, whatever you want, guys. This cave is preserved by the Lumen Association. Runners are advised to conduct oneself in accordance with the regulations. I have not read any regulations. Orbis, may Helios blessings upon us. Ceremonial signal. It's a Mirian shrine. Shrine. Helios Descent. This mural depicts how Helios drifted with Ignis for aeons, and when he heard that the gods were constantly tormented by their inner flames, he decided to help them use the lumen energy and descend it from the heavens. 
beautiful. All right, boy. Oh. Lira Kasami. Lumen plants are primarily used for medical purposes, most commonly in emergency military situations. A few even have the ability to repair cellular damage. It's no wonder that in Miri mythology there were countless stories of the pursuit of immortal life. Kaito! Do you hear me? Calm down. I hear you. I found it! Not bad. Try getting a sample as well. The cave looks well preserved. You're in the heart of the temple where the luminite is at its purest. You should be able to get a perfect source. So, don't step into it though. I won't be able to save you if you lose consciousness. Are you back on the ship? I don't hear any sound of the engine. I'm at the landing engines. Focus on your task. Sure, I'll focus on my task. Let's dig that in the water. And listen to the song. Lumen Cave 819 wrote in perfect star song the ripples of the luminite gave off brilliant eyes blue rays of light proof that the cave was of immense value Oh she eeps Memories These are the ancient race from the past and they communicated via song using their epic power of the voice and the vocals epic race how did they stop to exist? That's one of the questions that I've never been answered to. How did they destroy themselves? Was that the Lumen's consciousness? I should be careful not to get pulled in. Kai! I'm coming back. Let's go to the ship! You hear me? What happened to your signal? Kai! Eida! Eida! Are you able to reach Kai? I haven't heard anything from him. Wait. Something's not right. A ship just picked up the heat of... The heat signal of another engine in the vicinity. What do you mean? She means there might be another ship nearby. And it's probably not from Thousand Peaks. The heat pattern looks similar to your ship. There's someone else in the cave. Kaido! Kai! Do you hear me? A leader must remain calm, young master. How do you turn off this? Kai! Nice and quiet. How did the captain die? Lumen War, killed in the chaos of battle. We suspect it was. We suspect it was someone from the clan. And as always, after all, he was the seventh sun guardian. They never had too much power. To serve an honest man, is that too much to ask? It's best not to dwell in such things. You should think about where you will go from here. What's wrong with this clan and its endless power games? I'll doubt there'll be a long around for too long. Better find another house to serve all you can. What about a sixth son? Seems decent enough. After all the captain did for us, how could you dishonor him like that? Wake up, Kai. 
栄誉も何も話にならんだろう。Wake up, Kai. There's no point going on about honor when your master is gone. <laughs> Good lumen. Nani してる引っ張るな。Where are you going? Let go. どこのガキだ Who is this kid? タイイツのカゴ。But I am mercy. He's the eighth son. Don't you know him? Go away. I'm tired of all these sons. Show some kindness. The eighth house was born of peasantry and were defenseless when they lost the clans. Master affection. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to I wasn't crying. Boku a hahawe and a knockatem on a canakata. Dakara Ozisan Monakanaide. When my mom passed away, I didn't cry because she said the Lee clan must never cry. Boku got sweeter. So don't cry, okay? I'll take care of you. Kawai Hanaso Stano Kapozu. What is this kid babbling about? I wasn't babbling. Boku a hahawe to Hanaste Runda. I was talking about my mother. Kanoko Umaku eat the Nikara. Kogoni treat him in a doda. This kid is really something. Why don't you serve him instead? Only the helpless cry. I said I wasn't crying, kid. By Taiyang Mercy, don't you worry. Because one day I will become the clan's master and protect you from harm. Uh, you mind taking him away? Well, spoil the fun. Hey, kid, who taught you to say that? You should be careful who's around you when saying such things. My mother. Ah. Is that so? What did she tell you? My mother was the clan's master, and I was to protect them. She told me to become a clan master so I can protect others. Your father was the clan's master, and I was to protect them. She told me to become a clan master. Your mother wanted to protect others. Yeah. She wanted to protect people like her. And uh, who are the people like her? People who cry. People who are helpless. People like you, Mister. I wasn't. But I will protect you. Father is not going to let you be sad. Mother said the true clan master must watch over everyone, so no one ever has to suffer like her. Wakasama, Kaito Buran wa itsu ma demo anata no osoba ni. I, Kai Volan, will always be your guardian, young master. Tsushin Shadan wa minai no haidu ka? They'll be worried, you know, for going offline like that. Show yourself. Such a shame. I thought you'd know what to do when you saw my warning. <laughs> Don't waste your time. I would never betray him. As long as I'm here, no one can touch me. You two are pretty popular. Even a place like this has a bounty on you. Leave now. And I'll let you live. Why defend him? The clan lost its cave because of the Kyobo of the boy. I 
He risks, he risks his life to fight for your rights, you worthless bastards. And he disgraced the clan by insulting the Emperor. Perhaps I can atone for his sins by offering his head to the Emperor. He will redeem himself when he brings back more caves. Such loyalty, Kai Volan. But you know how we deal with exiled members? Shut up! Your petty power games will be the end of our clan. Kai, please reply. Do you hear me? Kai's vetals are dropping, something's wrong. Run, boy. Run, 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 run. Damn it. What's happening? Run, June. Move your butt. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Emergency, emergency, emergency. Go. Start running. Start running. Move those little legs. Move those little legs. Go. 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 Off we go. Faster. No, no, wrong direction. Here there was a staircase. Go. Drop down, buddy. Hurry, Jin. His vitals are becoming unstable. Ooh, she, guys. Ooh, no. Ooh, no, guys. We lost the signal. He was right in the entrance. I'm coming already. I'm coming. Jun, can you run a bit faster? You're like strolling. It's almost, it's 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 not even a run, it's a jog what you're doing. Move! Sprint! Why would there be a ship in the same heat pattern as Kun? Kai! Do you hear me? Let's go. Sprint faster, boy. Sprint faster. Kai! Kai! Sir. What happened? <laughs> Just had a fight. Kenko. It's nothing. Who did this? <laughs> it's fine. We just need to bring you back to the ship. <laughs> Slow down. Like Yoni. Don't touch the wounds. Ida, Kai is badly injured. He needs emergency treatment. How did this happen? I'm coming down. Stay where you are. This Listen, Jun. It was an assassin from the clan. Probably working for the third and fifth son. What? What? I drove him off, but you'll have to keep an eye out. I was expecting them to follow us all the way here. It must have been the bounty. <laughs> Good lumen. I can't see anymore. Don't look, we're heading back to the ship. Can you walk? Yeah. Just take it slow. That's embarrassing. What kind of guardian gets scary? Stop talking. Remember, Jun. Think before you act. Yes. And don't forget what you said. That you'll protect us from harm. Bring back Lumen. And become a worthy clan master. Yes. Also. Stop talking. Also. I said stop talking. The Lee Clan must never cry. I... 
教えてくれましたそうだったらイエスカイトカイラ起きてくれよ Wake up And it's the second time playing it, so. <sighs> Woo! Pretty heavy. Ah. <sighs> Self sacrifice always does it to me. I loved Kai. Really good dude. <sighs> Second time crying, same scene. I exactly knew what was going to happen and it still hit me very hard. <sighs> and this is just for starters, guys. This is just a warm up. Hey, can read the mood too. So what happened? He didn't say. Might have been a parrot. Can you help me find any nearby station who is willing to launch a space burial? Ah, oh, Stasia, thank you for sharing the tears. Don't listen to his dumb request about sending the spirits back to the ocean. United Mining has prohibited people from launching caskets into the war, into the space. There has to be a place beyond their control. Eddie, none of this is your fault. I know it's not, but that doesn't mean I didn't play a part in all this. You should stop getting yourself involved in other people's businesses. This is my fault, I... I want to do what I can to help it. So we won't be going to give time for now. It's a shame you don't need to feel... S it's a shame, but you don't need to feel sorry for the ocean is noble. As for those medical herbs you found, you'll be able to find someone to sell them to. Bounty still is on you, so be careful. Eddie lost it. She wants to find somewhere to launch a space burial. Remy, it appears you need me as much as I need you. You all are really making a mess out there, aren't you? Come on. How do you expect to find someone to launch a casket when you are got a bounty on you? Don't be mad at Ida. Maybe it's a sign that now is the time for us to be together. Come to my side and I'll... I'll tell you where to find a space burial. <clears throat> Your love, Benzel, Intel Broker. Hehe. <laughs> Die. Jokes aside, you really love Eddie, huh? Alright, I'll tell you. But you will come uh, have a drink with me already. Head to the infamous Silk, o Silk Oasis, the Black Market Bazaar. That's the main stomping ground for the Mirion Ignis Guild. Shouldn't be too far from you guys. There's a merchant named Lamar. You gotta be careful. He ain't friendly like me. 
Still, if you bring up my name, that should be that should be willing to help. Most popular guy around, Benzel, Intel broker. I was grateful to Benzel, but I was young, and it was hard for me to accept that as an exile, I couldn't handle everything myself. That was pretty heavy. Alright. How much fuel is this? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Just not enough. Must do like a, a pit stop somewhere. Abandoned signal? Sure, let's go. Lose some minor scavenging. Resupply facility? Sure, let's go there. Whatever that may be. Quick resupply and go. Incoming ship's ID. Crap. More pirates. They're here for the bounty. I never heard about messing with bones. What makes it difficult? What do we do? Pose a civilian? Should we try to charge through? Seems pretty dangerous. Uh, Bo. Shh. Signal mode one. Difficulty level 5. Sure, let's try. 5 is pretty half. From what I remember, the communication officer seemed confused about his mistake. So they just decided to let us go. Nice. We checked. 7 versus 5. Good. Let's go to the abandoned station and uh, get some uh, extra fuel. First year of Lumen War. Unhappy with the uniting mining interferences and in, uh, mining rights. Local peakers functioned from the asteroid belt clashed with United Mining. The ruins of this conflict was purchased by the Lumen Association and turned into a memorial. Um, yeah, memorial. Let's go have uh, some shopping. I'm sure plants June brought back have some cost. Sell some stuff. Selling everything. There we go. 2700. We need to buy some fuel. And buy some uh, kits. There we go. No. Sorry. Click too far. We leave this place. If you have any relatives that haven't been found, you can register them here and the foundation will help locate them. The voice of the veteran who spoke to some <coughs> to, uh, we spoke to sounded very mechanical. He used a speech device such like Ida, but it was a much more older model. Most of the workers here were veterans fitted with bionic pr prothesis, who returned after the war to live out their lives. You're here to fix the memorial. Sorry, we don't have work for healthy folks like you. Come back when life becomes too hard to handle. Wow. Pretty hard. Alright, we've got enough fuel to make the jump. Alright. What? It's beyond scanning. Okay, we must jump from uh, signal to signal. Sure. If we're too far, we're too far. That's good for me. What is this? Ring Liberation Front. Oh, red chamber heat signal has been locked on. Contact in 20 seconds. We're being tracked. It's the Bounce Brigade. They've locked into our engines to launch a boarding vessel. Uh, trick the boarding vessel. No, run like we always do. We did run, but we did got hit. How much? Two damage. That's chill. We can take some damage. We've got good platings. Better run than risk it and being captured. All right, another asteroid belt. The Ring Liberation Front was a local guerrilla faction located in the peaks. No matter how many times United Mining eradicated them, they always seem to rise again. Just like their motto, endless lumen light away, the belt may rise one day. Let's do some exploration and collect whatever we can find. What do we got? Ooh, spare ship parts, coating, starshine, nice. Lumen coating. It tempor <coughs> temporarily coats the sh ship. Some spare ship parts is also handy. And peaker starshine, a bit of booze. Nothing than a bit of booze to shine through the day. <coughs> Let's get some more stuff. Nice. Let's just exhaust this place completely. We've got everything, we've got everything now. We can do some <coughs> upgrades. <coughs> Apologies, guys. Uh, signal modifier. Yeah, signal power. That's what we need. More signal power so we can scan further. Exactly what we need. Makes traveling a bit more easier. Uh, more spare parts to improve the exploration kit. We can do that as well. But later. What is this? Plants. Plant selling prices. And more scanning power. Sure. We've done exploration here. Got it. Continue on to the final jump place. Scan. Especially with the small upgrades for a scanner. Black Market Bazaar. Silk Oasis. There we go. 
Hold and embrace. We're getting there. Getting an unknown communication request. Putting through now. My dearest East Ocean Prince and his pretty little witch. We heard you blew up bones, old hound. Amazing stuff. You think we could board your ship and get a photo? Bounty hunters again. Is the whole galaxy trying to get the reward? Red Chamber is just a radar vessel fitted with high-tech de detection and communication. There is no way we can take them head on. Poses a civilian. Oh, difficulty level 3. That's very low. We can definitely get above 3. Come on, easy. 8 versus 3. There we go. We just slide our way through there. Never figured the first time I visited the infamous city would be to hold a space burial. Legend has it that the owner used to work in the United Mining Border Patrol. One day he got into an argument with one of the superiors and put him in a hospital. As a result, he was fired. Ah, uh, you, you bunch of adventures looking for Lumen? Come on, have a drink, tell us a tale. Don't worry if you ain't got no story, if you got no luck cave running, and you need a few coins, I got plenty of work here. Sure, sure, buddy. May Ignis shed light upon your good deeds, after runners. Ignis shine. Ignis Shrine was the largest gathering place for the followers of the Myrian religion. The crowd was full of peddlers, peddlers and worshippers surrounding the main hall, turning it into a massive hub of commercial activity. The Ignis fate was led mostly by the Myrian Ignis Guild, who hoped that people would honor the sun through business and good deeds. Due to its simple doctrines, it eventually became the mainstream religion in the post-war peaks. Selling stolen lumen. All right, we're here to find caves, but not buy stolen goods. Ignis above. Thank you for the United Mining credits. What are we going to buy? We're not going to be buying stolen goods. I'm sorry. Self-righteous bastards. After mumbling a few cut words, the merchant turned around. It's a black market. We know. The Marian Ignis Guild was the largest religious and commercial organization in the asteroid belt and was the largest smuggling of lumen goods as well. Most that arrived here came for, for no other reason than to sell off their ill-gotten Ill items. Not a chance. You, you tell Benzel to pay what he owes me or we ain't talking business. His debt is none of our business. Then your burial is none of my business. Now move along. Because I got things to do. Hey! I thought peekers help peekers. What are you, some outsider? Ignis above, I'm a merchant. Uh, and a busy one too, so you'll excuse me. Please, I beg you. Arg. Why are you dropping to your knees like that? Get up, you're making me look bad. Please. I wish to send K back to her homeland. Get him up, it's embarrassing. Please help me. You're not around here. You're not from around here, are you? No one gets on their knees without offering up some credits. Unless they want people to think you're a phony. You're right. Anyone without credits is a phony, do you? I know you. You're the crew that recently had a bounty on you. You've got the wrong people. Nice try, now remember. That's an East Ocean Nota ritual. You've got the wrong. Relax, this place is full of criminals. I don't care about your tiny little bounty. Only beef I have is with you, witch. Uh oh. Whatever, get this man off the floor. Since you guys blew up the pirate base, I guess I can give you a hand. 
You, you mean you? I'll help you. Thank you, sir. Now hold on. Now hold on, I didn't say I'm going to do this for free. Helping out wanted folks will still put me at risk. See what I have here? The set of directions showed up on the black market a while ago. It took me some effort to get my hands on. Unfortunately, all the runners I know are booked. What are you proposing? I heard that one of you is a runner, so I'm giving you a copy of the directions. Help me check if this intel is legit. And I'll arrange your burial. Obtained key directions black market cave. If K knew that I had gotten my, on my knees for him, he'd be so upset. But it just meant that much to me. By light of Ignis, Miriam everlasting. May your favor shine upon us and cast darkness. Alright, let's buy some goods. Let's buy some fuel. Sure. Buy some armor. Sure. Buy some of this. Sure. There we go. Yep. Sell some goods. Some alcohol. Always sells good. Alright. Let's test. Let's go to the cave. What is this here? Due to recent uptake illegal excavation, United Mining has made an appeal to runners starting, stating that in the accordance with the Lumen Mining Act, anyone who discovers a cave may keep the legal rights to it as long as they pay 10% tax on the Lumen. For cave relative affairs, please report to the Lumen Association and do not attempt to sell stolen goods through legal means. 20 years of prison ended. My dear runner friends, revert and respect runner. Are you sick of all the artificial piling up on your ship? You know, I'm, okay, you just said uh, that's just advertisement, buddy. We don't need no advertisement from you. First of all, let's use the coordinates. Sure. Uh, the key location. Ooh, that's far. That is far. Here we go a bit further. Unite mining warning signal. What does that mean? Analyze. That's too far away for a signal. All right. I will just be doing small jumpsies. Small jumpsies. Let's go. Lumen cave number two. Sure. Whatever. Let's go travel. We have to go regardless. We don't have a choice. Alright, what is this? Mining expeditions and the flow of intel in Thousand Peaks. I couldn't believe that there would be any caves that hadn't been discovered. Yep, we don't need this. Abandoned signal. Keep on going, jump to jump. Ah, pirate radio. Sure, let's travel there. Six few left. Hopefully we can make it. Eddie, there's a ship that keeps following us. The Sailor Showdown with the Bones Brigade has made us heroes among the Astro Belts. So they want to board us, pose a civilian, tell them that sounds too risky, tell them we can do a video interview. Yep, they blasted us. They were indeed fakes, damn it. Could have been. It was a nice uh, catch, you know. We could have been. We could have become famous. Alright, we reached to the station. Remy got a refund. Remy, get a refund for Crimson Kettle. From what I remember, Ida tried to get the refund multiple times, but Remy would simply resubscribe for another year. Okay. Can we do some some talks? Uh, have June do it? It's not like they'll show face for X day. It's about witches. I guess it could help. Uh, no one would have guessed that the most popular broadcasting program, Thousand Peaks region, came from the small humble space station. A small group of workers wrestled with faulty equipment and chaotic space station, attempting to spread their cherished Thousand Peaks culture. Mm. It's about witches, I guess I could help. As soon as Ida saw the script, she walked away without saying a word, leaving the set in awkward silence. Apparently it was about an evil witch and how people managed to drive her from peaks. Aye, not good. We are going to be needing a place to uh, refuel somewhere. We've got six. Resupply facilities available. Perfect. That's all we need. Three few left. Eddie, we're getting a weird signal. Oh, fellow peekers. Heading to Toyon to party. Boys, fun. Ah, it's fine, fine. Come fly, trust me. 
He looks like a good guy. Wait, is that the barkeep on Basilka Oasis? Never thought I'd see a barkeep is drunk. What should we do? Uh, let him talk. I'll talk to him. Ida spoke highly of the other ship, and the barkeeper was ecstatic. Soon after, the container has been heading for a chamber. He said he regularly traded with Fortuna Entertainment, and that this was one of, of their better products. Oh, Fortuna Pipe. Nice. Fortuna Entertainment was probably the most well-known entertainment entity around. Their main operation was dealing lumen herbs, and they had small factories scattered around the belt. Tao, Tao Yuan was nothing more than a side business. I heard that smoking a stick of the lumen herbs increased fatality and is a cure all for our rage of illnesses. Sure, but we got a nice deal out of it. So can't complain over there. That's pretty good. I remember the dis disdainful look on their faces when I told Ida and Remy that I wanted to dock here. Some memories are best not spoken. Having fun in the city of dreams? If you spend all your money, you've got plenty of jobs. Just drop by, we need more credits. Sure, uh, let's go into the city and let's buy some stuff. Yes, uh, sell goods. Sell the pipes. Mm, not too pricey, actually. But fuel. Thank you. What is this? Lumen ginseng. Lumen plants are commonly traded items. No, let's not buy anything, but refill our armor. There we go. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Uh, navigator so we are in this belt uh, start scanning Ida yes use your voice to find the special case I love it whenever she prepares for the karaoke okay let's try to find the specific audio Beautiful. Murky with a song. The recording was murky, like a flurry of mixed emotions. Maybe think of the Silk Oasis, where the surrounding areas were full of pirates and middlemen traders. It was almost like the stories of space came alive in Ida sang. Star song analysis complete. Setting navigation to origin of Star song. We just need to reconfirm, that's all we need to do. Perfect, that's all we need to do. Analyze primordial cave signal. Asteroid 399. Should double check. It was smoother than I expected. Don't forget to thank Benzel. I'd rather block him. Don't say that, is the area safe? We don't want any unexpected visitors this time. If the directions really have been out in the market, I wouldn't be surprised to see other runners. Are you okay with this, Jun? I want to send Kay on his way as soon as possible. If you run into the pirates again, we're not helping you. We'll be waiting for you. I won't. I'll convince Remy, just do your thing. Eddie! Because of what happened to Kay, I was really anxious this time. I was willing to do anything for him. Perhaps I underestimated the peakers. You probably did, my boy. You probably did. You probably did. Asteroid 339, Lumen Cave. This is Jun. Entering the cave. Copy that. The the Keep your communications open. The mission is to confirm whether or not the space has been excavated. Alright guys, we will end it here. We will end it here. Was a wonderful uh was a wonderful moment. Ooh, I never thought I'd cry again after I have already seen the scenes before I've played this game. It still touches me so much. Alright, thank you very much for watching everybody. Thank you very much, Stacia, for following so intensely with me. Thank you, Will, for following. Thank you, Xavier. Thank you everybody who joined the live stream. Uh, thank you everybody who watched it after the live stream. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoy the game. If you want to play it yourself, I definitely advise to do so. It has many lore, so much beautiful things to uncover. And uh, yeah, I will live stream tomorrow again for three hours more. And probably Saturday I would like to finish the game. So we're gonna try to do it in three games. 
All right, guys, thank you much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, drop a comment down below, and I will see you next live stream. Bye bye, everyone. Ciao, ciao. Bye bye.